Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to determine the lowest structure for iodine trifluoride. It is a chemical formula of IF3 and to determine its structure we are first going to look at the number of valence electrons. Now here iodine atom has uh, 7 valence electrons and fluorine atom has 7 valence electrons as well. But as it has 3 uh, atoms of, of fluorine over here, we are going to multiply this number by 3. So in total we have 28 valence electrons for this molecule. Now here iodine atom will take the central position and all the fluorine atoms will be arranged around the central atom like this. To show a bond between uh, iodine and fluorine atoms, we are going to place a pair of electrons between each fluorine and iodine atom. Doing that we will be using up 6 valence electrons out of 28 over here and now we are left with 22 more valence electrons. So now we will first try to complete the octets of fluorine atoms as here each fluorine atom already has 2 valence electrons. We just need to place 6 valence electrons around fluorine atoms to show a complete octet. So let's do that. After doing that we have used up 18 more valence electrons. Um, out of 22 and we are just left with four valence electrons now these four electrons will be placed on the central atom over here and if you check the formal charges it will be zero for all the atoms in this molecule and you might wonder how can iodine have more than eight electrons in its octet well it is a group 5 element and it can have more than 8 valence electrons in its outer shell and hence iodine atom will have more than 8 electrons in its outer shell because it can accommodate more electrons. So this is the Lewis structure for IF3 and for more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.